Hey guys, Josh here, Squatch Topic PA. Hey. Uh, if you seen the live yesterday, um, you seen that we got this little tiny stove. Um, I gave it to my son Johnny, and he's been bugging me ever since that live was done. He's been bugging me, wanting to do a field test on that stove, the cooking egg, even though he don't like hey. eggs. Um, after the live, I got hurt. So, um, bear with me if you hear me wincing and whatnot when I move around. My back's killing me. But, uh, we're going to set his little stove up and we're going to field test it and cook an egg. <laughs> so, I'm going to field test his little stove. Let me get this camera turned around. And, no, 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 don't crack the egg yet. All right, let me get him. All right. Hold on, buddy. He's already getting going. All right, let me get down. Oh, God. Oh, man, that hurt. Uh, yes, sir. All right. I mean, I'm going to set the egg down here. Hang on, buddy. Give me your stove out. All right. So this is the stove. It's a trailblazer. Daddy, get my knife yeah. out. He, he, he loves his little feather light. <laughs> All right. So we're going to get his little stove set up. This is this little tiny thing here. Tiny stove. Your tiny stove. Daddy, let's get my. It's a trifold here, so you open it up like this. All right, look up, buddy. Nothing miraculous. It's easy. Set her down. I'm not gonna build a fancy fire or nothing. I'm just gonna use a little tea candle on it. Mommy, Daddy, my stuff is um, right there. But it's not behind me. Here's your fire starter, buddy. I'm not, like I said, I'm not doing nothing real special on it. We're just gonna cook an egg on it and test, see how not, if the if this little thing is nice. <laughs> so light, light the candle. You see that it went out. This is what happens when you don't coat your candles in wax. If you take these can, if you take these, uh, really? hang on, buddy. No, 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 no. You don't need to be playing with these. If, if you take your matches like these. Dip them in wax. And, uh, why'd you blow it out? Because <laughs> we need to cook in there. I know, but you need, you need, you need a flame to, um, to cook with, buddy. Here, oh. I, I brought, I brought Mommy's Nifty Lighter she got. Here, look out, buddy. I like what Mommy's Nifty Lighter that Jerry Ray wants so bad that she's too young for. Oh. Hang on, look out. Don't blow it out. <laughs> All right. So now that's on. Let me wipe this on. Put this on here. Well, I'll tell you right off the bat, this stand is. All right. You gotta watch how you set your Daddy. pot on there, because you see it, it's it's not very very sturdy on holding. Watch. It is not very sturdy. Oh wow. This actually sucks. Crap. Daddy here. Yeah buddy, hang on. The stove is really not even useful. I have to set it at a certain angle and if you dare bump it to stir your food, you're screwed. So uh, this this is an epic fail on this model. So uh, I brought my camp stove that they sent in the December box. And we're gonna test this stove out now. That stove, oh man, it wouldn't even hold the pot. So let me assemble this stove up real quick. Which which cooking egg in this? Yeah, we'll cook an egg on this one, buddy. That's this one. That's a good one. Yeah, this is probably a good one. Sides. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Contents under pressure to blow up, buddy. See? See how these are grooved? You, you line the... Oop! Watch, buddy. See how these are? Uh -huh. You line them up like that. See? Put those grooves. Snap them mm -hmm. in like this. 
And then this piece here goes in here. This stove is also from Trailblazer. So I, oop. See how they go on there, buddy? Put that set piece on. No, no, no. Line the top and the bottom is up. See how there's the two sets? You gotta line them all up. Right here, right here. Right. Yeah, go ahead. You got it. Good job. Now I gotta get the bottom done. There. Alright, as you as you see the these stoves like they're they're a pain in the butt to get together. Because they keep falling apart. Daddy. Which is I, I'm putting it together properly. Here, Daddy. I actually am. Um with these slats though, you have you have you can have this set up high or up low. So being that I'm gonna be setting this pan on it. I'm going to set this up high. Oh wait, maybe you can't set it up high. Hey, maybe you can, let me see. Nope, you can only have it set down low. I'm sorry, I correct myself. I apologize for that last sentence then. You can only have it set on the bottom. Alright, so now it's assembled. Be very careful when you're putting it back down because this thing will pop apart on you. Alright, so that first one's a piece of crap. Let's see how this Look one goes. Look what eyes! Um, Look what eyes right there. Ooh. It's red. Let me get a little fire going in this thing. So turn this around. I'm not gonna... Well, I'll use a lighter or a match. Let's see if we get an egg going on this stove. That little stove won't even hold nothing. It just falls right off because of the design. That design is an epic fail. No, 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 no. Don't put that one on there. That's too small. We're going to put this on here. Take these out so they do not ignite. Daddy. Yeah. Daddy. Look out, buddy. This, this is going to heat up. So I'm going to let this heat up a little bit. And we're going to try to cook an egg on here. So it... Sucks because of the handle. Alright. So this is going to take a minute to heat up. Daddy. <laughs> I'm going to mess this candle up. I know it, but I don't care. Hey, buddy. Get some of this dry stuff like this and put it in there. Watch your face. Don't put your face near this hole. Put it inside here. Daddy. Oh, boy, crikey, it went out. It sure did, it went out. And that stuff's not even wet right there. <laughs> Daddy, let me get some more. I just wanted to cook an egg. Look, I'm cheating. I'm using a bit. I'm cheating. Not you, the candle. Alright, I don't make the I don't like these stoves. I do not. Not at all. And I just killed my flame with that stupid leaf. Yep. Darn leaf. Oh, you guys actually get to see me with a lighter. That's a rare. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to feed this from the top and get this nice little hot stuff going in here before I put that pot on. What, Daddy? Yeah, we're going to get a little bit of a fire going in here, buddy. It's making it bigger. Yeah, that's the point. We want to cook something. So we start with very little. Don't touch or get your glove on fire or your mitten. We start with little and then you work to bigger. We're trying to heat this up in here so we can get this pan to warm up so we can cook this egg. 
but you feed your fire slowly so you don't suffocate it and it goes out on you. You want it to spread, but you need air in there. Air is called oxygen. And if you don't have enough oxygen, your fire can't breathe. And if your fire can't breathe, it goes out. Okay, buddy? Oh. Yeah. Do you see any little sticks anywhere, buddy? Any sticks? A plywood! Oh, let's get some little sticks to burn in here. The point is... Here. No, 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 we need something thicker, buddy. Like, I didn't bring nothing but saw or chop wet. That's too big. Um, oh well. I guess I'll just slowly feed this in here while we try to heat this pan. Oh, you took the nozzle off? Alright, let's see. We're gonna try cooking egg. We gotta get this to heat up. Don't Daddy. touch this though, it's gonna get hot. This stuff here ain't gonna burn too hot though. Alright. Should be putting sticks in here and stuff, but. Just trying to do a little egg, <laughs> you know? I'm just testing the stoves. So that first little stove that we got yesterday, that little trifold, is an epic failure. Can't even put nothing on it. So that's worth nothing but child's children's play toy. Oh crap, I got a shell in here. I suck at cooking. I suck at breaking eggs. Well Johnny started the egg. Ah before I get hurt. There we go. Alright. I smell it. You smell it? Uh huh. Yeah, I smell a taste. I smell flavor, Daddy. Don't put this lighter nowhere near that. It'll blow up. We have to keep feeding the fire though, Johnny. Well, the egg's cooking. So this little stove here is not bad. Uh, if you have a handle, you have to position it right to balance it properly. You know, keep feeding it. Thanks, buddy. Thank you very much. As you see, it works. Yeah, I got stuff in the egg. I don't care. We get to burn the snow. <laughs> you burn in snow? Yeah. There's some snow in there. Johnny, do you mind if I borrow your knife to move the egg around? Uh-huh. Thank you. Yeah, we making a lot of smoke. Making a lot of smoke. Oh, uh -huh, Daddy. We make a scrambled eggs down here. <laughs> Daddy, I'm afraid to. Scrambled eggs? Here. Here, I'll scramble her. Daddy, I sold chairs for us. This what? I sold some chairs. For us to sit on. Oh, the chair. You had one blew it all the way down there. No, Daddy. I, I know it's down there, buddy. The wind blew it down there that one day. So, if you're in, if you're looking in the market for a camp stove like these, this one here is not bad. Assembly is a pain in the butt because it likes to fall apart on you while you're assembling it. So, once you get it together, Johnny, what are you doing, buddy? 
Once you get it together, it's not bad. Just don't don't move it around, you know. Um, it, it serves its purpose. It's easy to feed through the port. Um, obviously, it's doing the job. You see, these. Uh, sorry, I have to keep watching over. It, it, you just, you know what I mean. But this this little trifold one here. This trifold one here was completely useless. Uh, the platform for it, it is so shallow, you can't really get much of anything fire wise going for cooking. Uh, the way it's designed, you can't balance nothing on it really. It, it, it's, it's an awful design. This one here, though, is not bad. <laughs> this one here is not bad at all. So, if you're looking for one of these stoves and you're going through Bud K and you're looking at the Charles Blazer brand, don't get this one. Go for this one if you're in a market, but I will suggest they have these black ones. They come in regular metal color, too, where they, they, they just open up like that. I, I suggest you go for one of those, but these ones here ain't bad, as you see. But, uh... <laughs> what, buddy? Help you fold it up. Well, hold on, buddy. The egg is almost done. I don't want to burn it. Oh. oh, here, come up here real quick. So yeah, um, I recommend this one. It, yeah, it's a pain in the butt to to assemble, but I mean, it, it's compact. It's extremely light. It, it does the job. It's easy to feed through the port here, you know, when you're when you're fueling your fire in there. It, it works nice. I like it. This one here is a piece of crap. Don't get this one. I'll unfold it that way when you're online looking at it. You know exactly which one it is. There you go. Do not purchase this one. It will fail you. This one's not bad. Okay. All right, well, let me take this off. Now that we got all this established, this was the gear review. Hold on, buddy. This was the gear review for the Trailblazer uh, cooking stove. <laughs> and we made an egg. Not bad at all. Pain in the butt to assemble. And this one is a piece of crap. So there you go, guys. There's my field review on the two stoves that we got from the Bud K mystery box. All right. I hope you guys have a squash-tastic day. I'm going to get out here and do some sled riding with my son, even though it's going to hurt like heck because I hurt my back yesterday. I should have went to the hospital, but I didn't. So I just deal with it. Uh, uh, they don't do nothing for tail bones. You just suffer. So, uh, I will catch you guys later. Love, peace, and squatch grease. And by the way, I, I want to give a couple shout outs. Uh, I want to give a shout out to my boy, the Dogman Avenger, or the Avenger Dogman. Woo! How? Buddy! I want to give a shout out to the Great Outdoors Biggie! can't do the, the uh, Ohio how like he does. I want to give a shout out to Jack the Cameraman. What's up? I want to give a very warm shout out to MT Paranormal Life. That is Mike Tornacosta. I want to give a shout out to Susie B. She's an artist. She has wonderful work. Hello, Naz Lover. Hello to JP and John P. Adventures. And there's so many more to say hello to, man, you know. Uh, I just, I, you guys are all awesome, you know what I mean? You guys are productive in this community, and, you know, Tar Heel Bigfoot, you rock. Um, who else is out there that I love? Just so many of you. 
you guys are wonderful people and I extend my love and I extend many blessings and also I, I want to let you guys know that uh, my my adopted mother-in-law Mama Bearclaw she is a native elder Blackfeet she's a medicine woman she had just started her own YouTube channel she's going to be giving teachings she will teach of the, her ancestors she will teach of history that we do not know of and she will be uh, uh, giving lessons of things that are just hidden you know Mama Bearclaw has so much knowledge she can spread to this world that is just not known to us you know our history ends when the settlers first arrived but the sad truth is history didn't end there history goes back way further and it's not documented so I, I'd like for you guys to go ahead and check her out you know she just started Daddy her channel she, she doesn't have much up yet but she will and, and I'd love for you guys to join her on her journey and, and, as she Daddy, reveals, no. you know, the wonders of this world that she has to teach. And uh, I, I extend many blessings. I love you all. Daddy, you that, out. <laughs> love, peace, it's God's grace. Ow! Whoop, whoop. Ow! <laughs> you got <a> snot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, peace. Yes, that was my burgers. Oh. <laughs> uh.